Hey y'all, welcome to the second part of my journey in creating a paper mache European hair. You'll see me deal with an ear mishap and add layer after layer of texture until I get the details and dimensions just right. Due to the length of the video, I have decided to make this a three part series. So you're gonna have to wait until next time to see the hair painted and varnished and ready to go in my window. I really hope you enjoy this journey. Please feel free to ask questions or leave a comment below. Here we go. I'm gonna start off by creating the ears. The first time around didn't work out, it was a little too low, so I've made a hole a little bit higher up on the head. I've decided that the ears are a little too long, so here I am starting to trim them down.
the ears are in. Now we begin the first layers of texture. Putting in the eye sockets now.
And there goes the ear. I've decided I'm going to wait until later to reattach the ear.
fingers crossed the ear holds up after it dries. And now for the bunny tail. So begins the second layer of texture. starting to add more details and definition of the face.
fix where I cracked the front paws.
hoping this is a final go at fluffing up the bunny tail. Final spin. took some time. A lot of time was also spent in waiting for each layer to completely dry before I could go in and add a new layer of texture. Fortunately for you, I spared you the viewing of the drying process. I really hope you enjoyed this video and the next one will be released in two weeks. If you are enjoying this series, please don't forget to click on the subscribe button and turn on notifications. That way you will be alerted each time I release a new video. Until next time.